Hey guys, and welcome back to another Moose Guide analysis video. Today we are going to be looking at Fat Mama herself, the fat blob of HP. Yum 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 focus blast. <laughs> We're looking at Chansey. Um, we all know what Chansey does. Chansey is a very easy Pokemon to build. Um, this is your set. So that's going to be Toss, Toxic, Stealth Rock, or Soft Boiled with Natural Cure. Serene Grace does nothing for you here, and Healer is a doubles only ability. Why Slash Me Toss? Uh, helps you break potential subs. The only problem you're going to find is when it comes to stuff like Sub DD, Zygarde, um, really anything above. Oh god, what's Zygarde's HP? What is Zygarde's HP? Uh, is it anything above 100? I think at that point. Mm, something like that. Like once you hit like a certain like base HP, which is always going to be 400 and four, since it is divisible evenly uh, by four. Um, the Sesame Toss isn't going to do anything, and you get completely walled. Toxic to wear down walls. Um, like non magic art club fable um really even just wearing down offensive threats like uh volcarona in some cases um just uh wearing down ash greninja as well or even just greninja tangro um stealth rock stealth rock does what stealth rock does it's a hazard and soft world for that recovery other options thunder wave or toxic I think this really depends on if your team needs a form of speed control, especially when we're looking at the likes of Magirna. Magirna's a bitch. I think we can all agree with that, agree that Magirna's a bitch. Uh, so Thunder Waving, Shift Gear Magirna is great. Thunder Waving, Volcarona, Greninja. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> the list goes on. Um, and then aromatherapy. Like, aromatherapy is great to be a cleric. Really up to you. Um, I personally like max HP, max defense for a couple different reasons. Because if we're looking at Chansey, uh, one, it is honestly one of the best natures you could go with. Um, like, if we're looking at, again, it's like Metacham, you, you die. Always, 100% die to a high jump kick. Uh, but really, anything else, you're taking less than half. Um, giving another example of, say, uh, Bishart as a D, I'd say plus two. This never KOs, even if it somehow gets to plus three. Uh, it, it has a good chance to KO, but it's not always, uh, it's not necessarily always going to get the, the knockout. Uh, you can always live this, which is beautiful. Uh, the problem is, chance is more of that special wall. And I think we all know this. Right? Because, like, like, let's think about the things that are really going to be knocking it out, fighting type wise, uh, in OU. Just specifically Megal Opening, uh, Keldeo, and Hollywood. So let's, let's look at this real quick. Lopani. Although attacking with high jump kick never dies. Let's look at Keldeo. Scarf, Secret Sword, never dies. Keldeo, Specs, you guessed it, never dies. And last up, we have Halucha. DC Sweeper, high jump kick unboosted, will never KO. Plus one, it will. I personally find that if you're running, say, no HP, you're in such a bad position. Look at that Halucha High Jump Kick Calc. Look at the Megalopony Calc. It'll always KO after Stealth Rock from full, or after, like, after Stealth Rock, it'll KO. And then versus Keldeo, uh, specs wise, like it's got the, it, it will KO after it has the chance more most likely of a chance to pick up a KO. 
that's a problem. That's why I run 248 HP. I, I personally like it because I take physical hits better. Because look at the defense stat. Um, other people run like 4 HP. 4 HP, max defense bull, and uh, max for that. That's a, com that's a huge judgment call. If you think that you want more fizz death, run fizz death. If you want, a if you want more spid death, run more spid death. <laughs> it's as simple as that. Uh, like Honestly, if we're looking at, say, just a, a really good example of this. Take for example, sand drill. This is how much an earthquake does, uh, unboosted, boosted, there you go. Um, F plus two. Life orb, earthquake. Tectonic rage, not doing it unless you're at plus two. Corkscrew crash will only do it if you're at, again, plus two. So it's really, it's a great mod. Do not get me wrong here. I actually just want to check. Okay, we are still recording. Uh, it's a great mod. You could easily pair this with anything. Because it's so just... Oh, Chansey. Oh, I need something that's defensive. Oh, what about Chansey? Alright, let's just throw it on here. It is that splashable. I think that if you really are... I think, looking at the other options, I would personally run Thunder Wave over Toxic most any day uh mainly because especially when looking at pairs for like just team members in general for pokemon uh that are slower than chansey uh you have stuff like you have a pokemon like uh really anything that wants to beat uh greninja in general, like anything faster, like Kingdra and the Rain, Keldeo is huge to try and beat. Um, because, like, the nice thing is, when you have Soft Boiled, you can try and rely on Paras to get to full health, switch out. Um, mm, sorry. Um, the likes of Metacham, if you want to run Adamant, works really, really needs it a lot. Uh, Mega Mawile, if you're not running a lot of speed. Mimic you, uh, Pinsir appreciates it. Uh, even the likes of uh, offensive Mega Scizor, <coughs> Tapu Bulu, Tapu Lele, Tyranitar. The list continues to grow. Right, teams that are really weak to Volcarona can lead with Chansey, click Thunder Wave, and that's basically good game for that person using Volcarona. That's huge, and I think that's just something that needs to be addressed. What is it checked by? Or who is it checked by? Bisharp for sure. Why? You've got that knockoff. Knockoff just destroys Chansey. That's not even an exaggeration. It loses its Violite. It loses its overall usefulness. Because you go from having really solid defenses. Face their plus one. So if we do the math, 119 times one and a half. And I'm about to do the math for you guys. Is 178. That's not much. It's going back down to 119. That's not a good thing. That's a terrible thing. Like, uh, yeah. <laughs> it, it, it's just so dependent on keeping into Violet. Like, Bisharp's really big. The likes of uh, Landorus. Whoa. Christ. Uh, the likes of Landorus is huge as well. Because it knocks off the item. Uh, Chansey just once is gone. Uh, Ferrothorn. Sorry. Uh, Ferrothorn. Because of, again, knockoff. Knock off the item. Deal a hell of a lot more damage. Chansey is also weak to getting taunted. So let's look at taunt. You know you. What Pokemon are most likely going to be using stuff like Taunt? Uh, Tapu Koko, for one. Uh, because Tapu Koko, if it's running more of a support set or the Magnet set, 
which is uh, Thunderbolt, Dazzling Gleam, uh, Hidden Power Ice, or uh, sorry, uh, Thunderbolt U-Turn, Hidden Power Ice, uh, or Hidden Power Fire. Taunt the Chansey, it's gone. Uh, Top of Finny can run Taunt, Top of Goko can run Taunt. Really, getting taunted is his worst nightmare. And honestly, aside from that, running out of soft boiled, running out of seismic toss, and toxic. The moment it starts to run out of these things, or how even let's say aromatherapy or heal bell, it's so screwed because what does it do at that point? Exactly. Very little. Because the moment you switch in a ghost type like Sableye, it's getting knocked off. And, and Chansey can't touch it because Toxic and Stealth Rock aren't going to hit it. And it can't even get up Stealth Rock thanks to that magic bounce. And to be perfectly honest, this is what Chansey is. This is Chansey. There, there's nothing else for Chansey. Except for this, which is kind of shitty, to be perfectly honest. And... I guess the only other move I could say is counter. Um... You know, you survive the hit, you click counter, KO the Megalopony, you KO the Calvio, the Halucha if you live the, the hit or whatnot. Here. But realistically, there's there's not much for you, like at all. Um, uh, so yeah, uh, really that's it for Chansey. I knew this was gonna be a quick video. Um, as always, guys, uh, if you did enjoy the video, please leave a like on it, as it does help out the channel quite a bit. Uh, let me know uh, what you like to run on Chansey, uh, whether it's the same sets as mine, maybe you have your own personal preference, leave those sets down in the comment section down below and please tell me why you enjoy that, why you enjoy using them. Uh, otherwise guys, I'm gonna get the heck out of here, I'll catch y'all later, peace out. <laughs>